Alright guys, so I wanted to show you what I got from Amazon and Kazrain's getting ready to give me a little preview. Apparently she really wants the something. Hey. Hey. It's not Christmas. Quit going through my box. Alright. Kazrain really likes mail. <laughs> She's so cute. This isn't for you. Alright, so Katherine's going to show you what I got in my Amazon box today. There's so much, she can't pick just one thing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You like Amazon boxes? Okay. So, the first thing I ordered was some Garden of Life Vitamin Code Raw Prenatals. I'm thinking about starting a family and I wanted to try a new prenatal vitamin. And I started researching everywhere on what to get and it was important to me it was important to me to get one that had a folate in it because folate is the most natural form and a lot of them have folic acid so I got one with the folate and this one for the price seemed to be pretty good because a lot of them can get really expensive so um, this one I chose and along with that I got some vitamin D3 it's supposed to help with the absorption of calcium. There's a little bit of D3 in the prenatal vitamin, but I wanted to bump that up. I figured you couldn't, uh, couldn't hurt to have more. So it places the calcium where it should be in your bones and instead of elsewhere in your body. So I got some of that. I also got some pregnancy tea, all organic. And that's supposed to be really good to take for your body. Uh, raspberry, it's got red raspberry leaf, oat straw, chamomile, dandelion leaf, nettle, peppermint, and alfalfa. I heard it tastes the best, so I tried that one. Got some compression socks. Ooh, ooh. My job, I'm on my feet all day, so I need to get some compression socks to help save my legs because they don't look too hot right now. Alright, next thing I got is uh, some whole mega new chapter. This is uh, the DHA portion of the prenatal. So I'd rather take something that's separate, separate DHA and separate prenatal. And this one's supposed to be really good. For some reason, I got two bottles of this, and I don't remember ordering two, but I might as well keep it because I think it's only 90, 90 gels in there. Well, I'll use it, so I've got two. One for backup. So I got a car charger for my phone. Last time we went up to the mountains, our phones died and we didn't have any way to charge them. So I figured this would be good for on the road. And I got a coffee tamper for our espresso machine. It's a nice heavy duty one, so I think that will make our espresso come out a little bit better. Lately it's been a little on the weak side, so this heavy duty tamper should make it really good. And the last thing I got is this Euro Cuisine All Natural Yogurt Culture. It's freeze dried yogurt. I've never tried a powdered mix like this. I've always gotten like a cup of yogurt and mixed it with my milk for my yogurt, but I wanted to try the powdered starter mix because I think it's got a lot more, um, a lot more of the bacteria in it than just the just getting a cup of yogurt at the store. So I'm gonna do a recipe video on how I make my yogurt and I'm gonna do it with this culture so we'll see how it turns out. Hopefully it'll be a lot thicker and tastier. It's supposed to give a really good tang with the yogurt culture. So that's everything I got from my Amazon box and Catherine is just so enthused. If you like my video please like the video down below and subscribe to my channel for more videos. Thanks guys! Bye!